Hey guys, welcome back to another video and today I'm joining you from the airport in Bologna I'm here with HRO and Lamborghini to have some fun driving cars around track which I've already said so It's a bit loud here, I hope you can hear me but you can see there's already Lamborghinis to welcome here an Urus, a Performante and a few other things A little bit tired from the flight, it's still early in the morning here One hour I think it is to get to the hotel So get there, chill out a little bit, the England game is on So that's super super important and then tomorrow is going to be all about Lamborghinis driving, get the drone up, loads of fun stuff. So yeah, let's go to the hotel. Okay, arrived now at the hotel. Um, the grand something, something, something. There's a nice globe here. Um, I uh, got to check in. No driving until tomorrow, but the outside looks incredible. Oh, look at that man over there. Beautiful. <laughs> and then you come out here. It is sunny, busy. I'll explore around later, uh, check out the hotel, see what's going on. And Mandy, you're going to show me around because you've been here so many times, right? <laughs> you're going to show me around. <laughs> okay, checked in, go to the room. And I really want to swim. I want to go out. The beach is like just there as well, so hopefully I can go there as well. Holidays as well as car stuff as well, don't worry. The okay, the sun is setting, and um, after a very interesting dark game with Mandeep and Rui. I won. It's been very interesting. How'd it go, Mandeep? Very good. <laughs> Not very good. Uh, the goodie bag has arrived. This is what happens when you spend loads of money with Lamborghini. It's really, really good stuff here. You get this really, really nice towel. Super, <laughs> super soft, because the rooms don't have it. And then, we get these nice headphones as well, From which are China. really nice as well. Beats by really Dre. Nice. Beats by Dre. From China. Which aren't really as well. Knock off Beats by Dre. Now, but it's been quite a good reception here. Um, food to come. And then all day driving track tomorrow until like 10 p.m., right? 10 p.m. on track. And uh, me and Mandy are racing tomorrow. Yep. Yeah? We're racing tomorrow, so that should be quite interesting. There's a pool over drone. there. Um, oh, and my drone in my bag. One off. One off bag. Important calls. Right, badge is on. That's the wrong side. Badge is on, ready to go. Um, like I said, all the racing stuff is tomorrow, but let me do a quick room tour. Okay, so there's the entrance. On the side here, you've got like a little storage cupboardy thingy over here. This is the room, pretty nice, not bad. Um, got quite a good view out there as well. Nice bathroom here, very nice little tub. For me and myself, and pretty decent-ish view. The curtains that open like that out towards there so you can see the hills and stuff like that. But like I said, today is dinner. So I'm gonna try and get a few bits. I might take it on my phone, I don't think I'll be bothered to take the camera down. Um, and then hopefully an early night because tomorrow is an early start. They've given me some sort of a program down here which I'm gonna try and have a look at so you guys can see. Let me put it down here so you can have a look. So dinner today, tomorrow nine o'clock is transferred to Mizano circuit. Welcome briefing and then um, track activities, lunch, etc. And we'll be going till 10.45 before the transfer. So we'll be racing, if you can see here, night hot laps at 10 o'clock, which will be really cool to be on Misano circuit and be racing um, at night time. That would be kind of cool. As I mentioned, I think there are Performantes, there are Hurricanes, there are Aventador S's. And the one that I'm looking forward to the most is not the Aventador S, not the Hurricane, but the Performante because I've not had the opportunity to drive that on track yet. I've not had the opportunity to drive my own car on track. I love that car so much as you guys have seen from a previous video. If you've not seen that video, click up there um, and it will explain how much I love that car. So I'm gonna do a quick change, um, head down for a little bit of food, see what they've got. And then as I mentioned, early night, I'll see you tomorrow. So we have arrived at track, as you can see. Cars are all behind, Puffermantes, Aventador S's, Hurricanes, two-wheel drive, four-wheel drive, everything. It is sunny here today, it is warm, and we are gonna be driving all day, literally until I think 10 o'clock at night, so it's gonna be super, super fun. The car that I'm looking forward to the most, I keep saying this, is the Puffermante. Forget the Aventador S, forget anything else. I hope I get to jump into the Urus at the end. I believe we are following that on track. Time for a debrief, all that kind of stuff. I think a little bit of food, which is important, because we need the energy for the whole day. And then, track is behind us there, so I'm gonna try and show you around as much as possible, get the GoPros in the cars and everything like that as well. Okay, see you inside. Thank you. 
first few sessions are actually done now. Um, but there is a tornado, which I tried to film a little bit, kind of loom here. So if you look outside, the skies are getting really dark. I can't see it right now. But um, we were advised that it was at the hotel uh, where we are, which isn't too far from here. And the tornado is on its way. So the moment all we'll be doing is kind of like sighting laps, just going around, getting a feel for the track, understanding um, the corners, the braking points and all that kind of thing. Stick the GoPro in some new positions now. I think next time is Aventador S. So that was all for Mante. Um, I have to drive the Aventador S, so I'm going to take that out as well. And then we'll get some more time out there. They've also got a little skid pan here as well. So in the meantime, we're going to have a little bit of fun. I think I'll shut the drone up if it doesn't get taken away by the tornado. Um, and just like skid the cars around a little bit as well. But nice little suite they've got here at most. And I think you guys have seen from my previous video, Roger Duby. Nice suite here where they're going to serve food and everything. If you click up there, you will see a previous video from Silverstone. Um, let me take that out on track as well. So, yeah. Okay, it is raining a little bit. Cars are going out again. So I'm going to kind of try and stand a little bit in the shade. But it's annoying that the rain's coming down. Hopefully it looks like it's clearing. But I thought I'll show you the cars quickly here, the ones that we're not driving. So Aventador S Roadster looking really good in this color. Love this color, looks amazing, like a highlighter yellow. This is crazy, and check the interior as well on this. Have a look at that. It's like a browny kind of color as well. Nice Oregon there, nice perf color, which I don't think I've seen before. This kind of bluey green, um, and then a red Hurricane and a few other cars down there. Um, they've saving me a lot of time and effort here because they're putting track telemetry in the car. So there's gonna be videos and everything from inside the car which they're gonna give me, which is uh, like a little, little USB stick, which saves Blue Marlin, who edits all the videos by the way, follow him on Instagram, it's over here. Um, it's gonna save a lot of time putting stuff together because the view should be from the front from the back and here the Aventador is going around track as well. One thing just as a little bit of an update is honestly I've been so surprised at how amazing the Aventador is around track. Um, I only wanted to drive the Performante but the Aventador has been incredible. Okay I'm gonna get out of the rain and then hopefully the next scene is me on track. Okay, I've still been out in Puff Mante, hopefully you've seen the video, but I am going to jump in to the Urus now for the first time. So, this is going to be interesting. We have Lorenzo here, who's going to take us for a ride. Are you going to give it some? He's like, no, I give you the Urus experience. I'd not go too fast. You shut the door now. Then there are the two off-road mode. Sand. Okay. Mm. You can have oh, what you want. That's fine. Torque, Got power, policy. tilt angle, torque displacement on the wheel. No if I just play, so you can adapt. Okay, we leave you to do it. You okay. So you can play like the event today, comfort, yeah. balanced sport for traction, so power for the powertrain, the steering, and the damper. Then you activate the ego mode, and you have you can play with the with the two mode. Come on, Lorenzo! Come on. Started. This turbine is more powerful than a helmet. Now when you go in course, I have a lot of power. So in course mode you don't need to look here, you can just look the... You can have the tool in the back, you can tow till uh, 3.5 tons, the box roof, 100 kilo, 4 liter double turbo, 650 horsepower. Wow. done in the Urus as you've seen actually surprisingly really really fast car genuinely genuinely surprised love the interior of this car I haven't done a proper video on it yet hoping to do one soon but nice cockpit over here you've got uh, carbon fiber 
a really, really nice cockpit. Of course, it's like the Audi. Same company, nice, and the back here as well. But like I said, surprisingly, surprisingly fast. Interesting, and also the, the coolest thing is in Strata mode, it's just super comfy. Question is, should I buy one? So everybody leave a comment below, should I get one of these cars? I don't actually have one on order, um, although I'm getting London saying to order one, so let me know, comment below, should I order this car? And if I do, what color? Okay, let me know. So the sun is starting to set here, and as I mentioned before, it's gonna be night driving. Hopefully now you've seen some of the clips of uh, going out on track, and either before this or after this, it's up to blue, you're gonna be seeing the drone footage that I got, which I tried to do without losing the drone. It's pretty amazing, check out the sky behind me there. It's like a purpley red color. I've got all the colors of the rainbow behind me, and as you can see, most of the cars are out, so there's nothing really there. It has been an amazing, amazing day. I've actually still got about an hour and a half of driving to do, so um, it's not the end yet, and hopefully now, after this, they're gonna record inside the car, going around the track as the sun's setting as well, because you guys have seen the one before. Fingers crossed I can beat the lap time, because before, you just got to kind of go around, um, and it was like an, it was an out lap and then an in lap as well, so you didn't get to do one full lap. So hopefully I can get two minutes, 15 seconds, or something like that on a lap, I'll be happy with that. I'll be really, really happy with that. But everybody's been amazing here. I genuinely recommend this for anybody who, who wants to do it. Um, I think some of them can be quite pricey, uh, but there are some that you can do that are not that expensive. And I think that's been the biggest thing for me today, is the Aventador. I've genuinely been shocked at about how amazing the Aventador S is actually on track. And I've liked the one here with the bucket seats as well, not the comfy seats that I had. But of course, you can't have that on the road. So, yeah, it's been an amazing day. I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. It might be a little bit of a last bit, but I think I might sign out here. But Blue's gonna put the nice, cool stuff coming up afterwards there. So, I'm gonna go chill out now. I've been filming, filming, filming. It's been a long day. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please remember to like, subscribe, do all the other bits. Stay put for what else is coming. The Portofino is coming this month, July. July, so it's end of June, but July the Portofino is arriving. So there's gonna be that content as well, and hopefully a little trip to Italy again for more and more driving. Anyway, remember to subscribe. Um, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want more content like this, then tell me. But yeah, I'll see you soon. Bye. done but actually there is one last thing to do which is gonna be pretty cool so I've got my helmet and you can see all the cars lined up behind me I'm gonna go for a hot lap in one of the cars so I don't know which one I'm going in yet so I'll go for a hot lap in one of the cars nighttime from Mizano track kind of what dreams are made of aren't they so I'm gonna video as much as I can but if this is shaking all over the place then that's not gonna be my fault because I'm gonna go fast so the professional driver is gonna take us around anyway let's see which car I'm in